Many of my patients ask me whether exercise can potentially modify the course of the disease. Uh, it's a very interesting and relevant question and the shortest and most honest answer is we don't know. There is very exciting work from rodents who were given an experimental form of Parkinsonism that exercise may modify uh, the course of their disease. Uh, what these uh, exercise rodents were showing is A, they fared better clinically, but when they looked at the brain after death, you saw that uh, the dopamine receptors were increased and that dopamine reuptake sites were also increased. And this may help these rodents uh, to maintain their dopaminergic system in a better way. Whether this can be translated to humans, we don't know uh, yet. There are very uh, exciting trials ongoing now to address this issue in humans with Parkinson's disease, um, including a big trial, the PARC-FIT study in the Netherlands, uh, recruiting over 700 patients with Parkinson's disease. But the results will probably um, uh, be there only in one or two years. While we're waiting for this new evidence, I think it is very important for patients with Parkinson's disease to exercise. Exercise has generic uh, health effects, uh, for example, on the cardiovascular system, uh, hearts and lungs and muscles. And in addition, patients have problems with sleep, constipation, uh, that may improve with exercise. Uh, what is crucial, though, is that patients need to find a way to exercise in a safe manner, uh, because exercise as an adverse effect may increase the risk of falling. So I always recommend my patients to discuss a good exercise program with an experienced physiotherapist. And exercises to consider is, for example, pole striding, which is hugely pop popular in the Netherlands. You see all the patients running with their pole strides across the street. Um, but maybe if, if falling is an issue, then uh, a home trainer can be a, a perfect way to exercise. And um, if you're considering exercise, international recommendations state that um, three times a week, 45 minutes, at about 70% of maximum heart rate, is uh, the, the minimum you should do each week. And that's a good way to, um, to start your exercises tomorrow.